a list of things you want to try or places you want to go, you just haven't got round to it yet, this is the show to get you going and maybe even give you some ideas for things you haven't even thought about yet. Welcome to Over 50 So What? I'm Carol O'Halloran. For all the regulars and not so regulars, today we're going to take a look at what happens behind the scenes at the Antennas TV Awards. And you'll get to meet some of the people who help put this show together. We also visit a U3A writers group, whether it's poems, essays, radio plays. You can get started, even if you're over 50, with no writing experience. Of course, everybody, please join in the five minute fitness and have fun at your current level of mobility. Movement is a medicine. Let's go. And here we are, it's so exciting. We're at the Antennas Awards 2023. I wish us luck, we're up for two categories, Best Seniors Program and Best Seniors Personality. Here's the amazing Sandy. I couldn't do the show without her. She has such incredible input, her years and years of expertise. Not that you're, you know, that old. You're still younger than me. <laughs> okay, you wanna see the back of my dress? Well, it's so fantastic to dress up and glam and buy a really nice, outfit you know sometimes they say it's mutton dressed as lamb but it's better than mutton dressed as mutton so if you get a chance to dress up do it hi i'm maddie hey. it's nice to meet you what's your name uh, carol my name's carol. carol like christmas carol i love it i love yeah. it fantastic do you want me on and the maddie? other side sorry continuity oh Woo. my heels gone in the hole again. i don't want you to fall in there that'd be quite bad <laughs> Keep filming, keep filming. Excuse me, don't they know that I'm doing behind the antennas? Oh my God, there's no respect around here. Um, no, I'm so excited to be here tonight with Carol. Carol, can you tell me a bit about yourself? Well, this is my very, very first antennas, so I'm really, really excited to meet all these legends of uh, community TV and to be hosting one of the categories as well and then meeting all the other finalists. It's just awesome for community TV. Keep it going, keep us on air. Yes, absolutely. And um, let me tell you, your dress tonight, I am obsessed. You are, oh my God, absolutely immaculate. Um, where is this from? Uh, well, you won't believe it. It was a little place in Springvale Road. <laughs> Springvale Road, shout out. Forget Chadston, forget all those big high-end stores. You just go somewhere else, like, out of the way. Out of the way, absolutely. Well, it is so exciting to have you here tonight. Is there anything that you would like to say to the viewers at home or people at Channel 31? Well, I'd like to say to the viewers at home, if you're over 50, over 60, over 70, just get out, dress up, have some fun. Go and do anything you like. And Channel 31, thank you so much for your support. You and the team and Maddie and the Shane and, and all, everybody else at Channel 31. Thank you so much and thanks to the antennas. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. I hope you have the best night. Um, you're amazing. Thank you so much for your time. Um, I'll see you down there. Yeah, amazing. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Cheers. Hi, I'm, here, I'm here with a glamorous lady from the over 50s. Isn't she, isn't she incredible? <laughs> What's amazing. your name? Brad. Brad. So yeah. who are you with? Uh, getting dressed with Brad. Getting, is that getting what your show is called? Brad. Getting no, dressed with shame, Brad? Shameless plug. Yeah, sh oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> so here you can see we're having lots of fun at the Antennas Awards 2023. They haven't had an Antennas Award since 2019 because of, you know, so to be here in the flesh and the awards, the last one was two years ago, but it was done via Zoom. So it's very exciting to meet all the other producers and people working in community television. Well, I started off, uh, I 
I saw Danny Oliver shooting on his phone and I thought I could do this <laughs> in the middle of lockdown. So I got a camera this big and then I started. And then I got to two cameras, three cameras, and then I have to say, two weeks ago I had at least five cameras. <laughs> I, had a cam I had a camera on my chest. <laughs> I had a drone in the air, I had cameras mounted all over the place, so I've seen a massive progression in my work in front of the camera, so I can only imagine what goes on behind the camera. Ah, oh, exactly. Oh, we have to get on the nominees for Outstanding Camera Work and a Program. Ah! Oh. Congratulations to this year's uh, recipient of the Stella Young Contribution to Community Award, Carol O'Halloran. Now, I was so honoured to receive the Stella Young Award because she had such big shoes to fill, you know, being such an amazing activist in the disability space. And she had a community TV show called No Limits. And what we try to do with our show, Over 50, So What?, is show that older, there are no limits on what older Australians are capable of. I'd like to thank Shane and his team at Channel 31 for giving me a go in the middle of a lockdown with my tiny camera. <laughs> I'd like to thank Channel 44 and Adelaide as well, and also the Community Broadcasting Foundation for helping, out, helping us out with some funding. The show would not be possible without this core team behind me, and they're all over 50, over 60, and over 70. <laughs> And this gentleman here, Richard Benz, he came on board very early in the piece and he has been the most dedicated supporter out with me in the community, Warnable, up to Echuca, all over the place. He's been absolutely amazing, his expertise, Richard Benz. And also some amazing camera work and editing by Sandy Miller, who I've got up here. And, and uh, Richard Brown, who couldn't be with us today. He was the one that had mics on my chest, I mean, you know, cameras on my chest. And thanks also to Teresa and Faye. Faye, you would have seen in the fitness segments as well, and Teresa helps with production. <laughs> I'd also like to thank all the viewers and all those community organisations out there who are providing products and services for us older Australians. I've met many of these associations and they are fantastic. Every week, I meet people who inspire me. It could be a 64-year-old getting on a bicycle for the first time, 64. Could be a 70-year-old starting a technology business. It could be an 85-year-old right up in the treetops, walking on the high ropes. And it could be a 90-year-old singing, laughing, and making the most out of life. Age isn't just a number, it's an attitude. Over 50, so what? <laughs> Thanks, antennas. I am here with Carol, who just won the Stella Young Award. How are you feeling? Oh, it's just the most incredible honour. I mean, the big shoes to fill, Stella. She was an amazing activist in disability, and I like to think that uh, we're, we're doing amazing activist things and uh, positive ageing. Oh, absolutely. You should be so proud. You've done incredible things. Oh, my gosh. What are you going to do with this award? Where are you going to put it? Uh, well, I'm going to have to put something behind it so I can read it. So. <laughs> I know. It's so clear, isn't it? 
Well, obviously it's going to go, yes, pride, pride of place in my house. And, and it'll inspire me to keep going and keep doing good work for the community and involving all the community organisations and, and having fun with people into their 90s and beyond. Oh, that's so fantastic. Well, congratulations once again. So well deserved. I hope you have a great rest of your night. Jeez. Whoa, it's all exciting here. Fantastic. Thanks for watching our TV show. Be sure to hit subscribe and then you'll never miss an episode. Jump on Facebook, join our group, get in on the fun, fitness, wellness and inspiration. I'm Carol, over 50, so what? <laughs>